The whistling is actually accurate. Explosions go up and out. Yeah, let's go, baby. Yeah, it's not back. just a breaching tool. <laughs> I'd take that shot 10 times out of 10. It's almost like an afterthought. You know, like you take the shot and then maybe you think about it, oh, that was a pretty close shot, you know, but there's no question. Hey, what's going on, everybody? My name is Cameron Fath. I am a former Army Ranger out of 2nd Ranger Battalion at Fort Lewis, Washington. Hey, everybody, my name is Israel Wright. I was a Special Forces Green Beret, also out of Fort Lewis, Washington. And we are excited to be back with another opportunity to hang with you guys. What are we gonna be looking at today, dude? Today we're gonna be looking at Call of Duty Modern Warfare, the Embassy Mission. Let's get it started. Man, Price, that facial hair never goes out of style. Never goes out of style, and it doesn't age either. Yeah, that's right. Nor does Price. Combat keeps it young. Everyone wants to know the secret to beauty. Yeah. War. <laughs> little protest little party, going. Little party going on. Oh, they've got it. They've oh, got fast in. rope in. All right, dude. You had a little bit of experience, yeah. right? Oh, yeah. I every never year. did anything like that. Really? No. Every year we have to certify on the fast rope. Uh-oh. Do you have to certify in fast roping out of a crashing helicopter? No, just a one that's not crashing. That's so scary. With all that combat equipment Is weighing that... you down. Yeah, right. That hurts. Yeah, you drop with a lot more force when you got like 30 pounds of gear on you. So you drop like a rock. Get your hat. Price. Yeah, nobody's ever seen Price without a hat. He just saves money on haircuts, keeps it shaved. <laughs> okay, just going in with a pistol? What happened to your weapon, dude? Yeah, right. You better pick up something quick, I guess. So they're trying to get into the embassy, and we're trying to get to the wolf as well. We're both after the same guy. Okay. I love it. He's like, Everyone's no, like, we're not who here are for you? you guys? And they're no, like, just running around with guns. Your, we're not your ex, Phil. Mm-mm. <laughs> Yeah, Price's kit is always set up so well. Yeah, so slick. Yeah. yeah, that's the one thing I do appreciate that Call of Duty takes a lot of time in, yeah. is researching and like understanding actually kit designs. Like the gameplay might be a little like obscure and ridiculous at times, but the accuracy of like equipment used is phenomenal. Uh-oh, yeah. bulletproof glass. Oh, I love it. Jesus. Oh, Jiminy Christmas. And yet yeah, we're not even paying mind to that. Price is just keeps movies like, oh, that's yeah. just a Tuesday. Oh, I hate this. Oh, come on. Family, he has my family. Oh, no. Sorry, brother. Sorry, you're man. just gonna have to keep it moving. Ah, oh. mm -mm. rough. Happens, you're gonna man. get yours, butcher. Is that the butcher? That's the butcher right there. Yeah, he's trying to get in. Really? Talk about a dude that's like the least intimidating guy ever. He's wearing a soccer jersey yeah. to a firefight. Yeah, right. The Church web above. gear doesn't make you look tougher. Man. Yeah, yeah, where's the trench coat? Where's the eye patch? We need a real bad looking bad guy here. <laughs> Is that a Hilux truck? That's one tough truck. That's to a be high, able to, yeah. Yeah, to be able to bust through an embassy wall like that. Exactly. I love the Hilux. It's yeah. not available in the States. Yeah, right. Only overseas. Yeah. Only overseas. That thing is badass. We had them overseas, and yeah. I want one they can take so anything. bad. Yeah. Anything. It's a Tacoma on steroids. Yeah. I love it. All bulletproof yeah, glass, so we got good cover. May not be concealment, because you can see right through it, but boom, dude. Wow. Get, get bunkered, brother. I this guy plays it. paintball. Yeah. Yeah, this is a sticky situation. They're kind of right on top of each other exactly. as they move through. Especially just group. two guys yeah, just trying two. to take out this force and your yeah. leapfrogging, you gotta worry about frontline trades, you gotta worry about cross coverage, you gotta worry about accidentally shooting your own guy when you're bounding up yeah. on each side. Price and Garrick, they've been through everything together. They yeah. know each other's moves. Oh, look out. Tier one yeah. operators. Oh. Yeah, let's go, baby. Yeah, it's not back. just a breaching tool. <laughs> That's love badass, that. love that. You're standing right there. Hey, don't stand in front of the door, on, man. Price. Fatal funnel. A little lazy sometimes. Okay. Oh, hey, there are guys. It's the crew. We're back together again. I'm pretty sure I saw that chick in Syria. Actually, it was very interesting because they have a entire woman fighting force over there. No kidding. Yeah, they were badass, and they wow. were right next to the compound and like secret crush. Dude, it was awesome. Warrior princess. Warrior princess. Every man needs one. Mr. Ambassador. I can hear you, but... Save the ambassador. Come on, you're gonna be okay, buddy. Oh, you're not oh, gonna be okay. You're executed. So much for the cushy appointment. See, that guy looks like a bad guy. He's got the robes on. Yeah. He's not running around <laughs> he's, in a he's soccer playing jersey. playing the part. Yeah, easily to recognize on the battle. Exactly. You want to take out that guy's morale? Just kill Messi. Kill yeah. Ronaldo. Kill one of those guys, and he's gonna stop fighting. You're so cruel. War is cruel. 
All right, we're gonna save somebody here. Oh, I love it. Yeah, leading her out. Oh man. What are you gonna do with this guy? Tapping into the cameras. You gotta lead her out. You gotta guide her the whole way. Okay. No, I'm oh, sorry. You gotta, you gotta keep going. Self aid. No. What are you doing? If you're in a situation, you gotta get out of there. Yeah, no, there they come. Oh no. Let's see. Oh. Neo. Are we playing the PC? agents are coming for you, Neo. Get to the garage. Ooh, yeah, 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 there we go. Let's just line up like stormtroopers. Exactly. <laughs> Said with better aim. I will be gone, brother, but we will meet again. Get in there, Wolf. You stay in that yeah. refrigerator. You're on timeout, bro. So this looks like, I wonder if they kind of ripped from the headlines a little bit of Benghazi, because now we're holed up in some place outside the embassy, kind of like the annex situation. Mm -hmm. Thanks, Hillary. Uh, wasn't gonna say anything. I can't <laughs> shut up about it. <laughs> yeah, but man, no, there was a coordinated attack, you know, back in 2012, Benghazi, Libya. They attacked the embassy. Unfortunately, we lost uh, our ambassador there, and then another guy, and then they holed up. There was a mile away, there was an annex and then they brought everybody to the annex and then they got attacked there as well. So this yeah. looks very similar to the setup, kind of an urban area. So I wonder if they didn't take a couple of cues from that situation. That was a sticky situation. Yeah. All right. Okay, send that mortar, brother. A little illumination, I like it. Oh yeah, a little loom round. Oh yeah, he's an M14. Just picked it up out of nowhere, huh? That's the thing you gotta worry about, like in the real world. The real world. Like you actually have to zero these weapons per the individual. Right. So like, right. like if you pick up a gun and you aim it, there's a big chance that those bullets aren't gonna go where you want them to go because that sight isn't zeroed for that gun. And not to mention different zeros equate to different distances. So you can zero your gun at 25 meters, you can zero your gun at 100 meters, right. and every zero you do is gonna throw your bullets off completely and it's up to the user to know their hold. If you pick up a gun and you point and aim, you might not hit what you want because of the reticle. Yeah. The more you know. Get down! That's a close mortar fire. Nice. Yeah, we need to get out of here. Uh, oh boy! Incoming! Oh, get down! No. Oh, buddy. Uh, the whistling is actually accurate on oh, mortar really? fires when they come. I didn't come thought in. a mortar didn't. Uh, I was yeah. never in any mortar fire, so. so yeah, it's, you actually hear the whistle when it comes in. It's like. That's how you know. That's why incoming battle drill get down because when a mortar strikes, explosions go up and out. Yeah. So that's the reason why you would lay down flat. Right. I mean, it'd save your ass if it struck close enough, but right. I mean, that's just leaving it up to chance. But right. definitely getting Benghazi feels from this right, right. now. Right. Yeah. Birds inbound for close air. On drone. Low what fuel. is that? That's the super laser. Super laser? Um. Price makes me feel when he looks into my eyes, I feel like I can do anything. In, in those dark, forgotten eyes, there is a heart. The heart of a soldier. Exactly. I like that man on man contact. Yeah. That lets you know he's like. It's the brotherhood. It's the brotherhood of war. Use laser marking. So that is actually accurate. Either we didn't have any much use for him for our particular mission, or we just didn't have him around. But uh, this is not very familiar to me. We never had any experience, especially not calling in fire with like a drone or anything like that. The ones we used, because we had something similar to this, uh, but it wasn't visible laser, it was IR, and it would be like a giant lightsaber that went for miles. And you could actually mark targets with that and call for fire on there, or mark targets for gun runs, or just calling in a bird, you can lasso them in and be like, hey, actually land here because we need you. The only experience I had with the IR stuff is trying to find a house in a neighborhood you've never been in before you have a surveillance bird they could sparkle the house with yeah. this IR and you couldn't see it to the naked eye but you could see the house is lit up like a Christmas tree yeah, it's like God's laser you're like show me the way and this laser would come out of nowhere and you had no idea where it'd come from badass okay use that 203 dude 40 right. mic mic is there we go again 40 mic mic I'm back people <laughs> yeah 40 Mike Mike is one of the greatest assets on the battlefield. You can clear dead space with it, you can clear defilade with that. You can launch that sucker over walls, just make sure you're in your maximum arming distance, because you know when you like can kill someone in Call of Duty just by hitting them with the 40 Mike Mike up right, front? Right. Yeah, that's a real thing. It won't go unless it's past its arming distance, which is usually around like five to seven. That means foot. arming distance. You mean after you fire it, it arms itself after it yeah. goes a certain distance. I think it's around, don't quote me on this, but I think it's around 35 meters past that. Otherwise, it'd be like in Terminator 2, just fire it point blank and read yeah, the, the smoke rounds in the guy's gut. Yeah, accurate. <laughs> yeah, dude, shoot through the wall. Just don't shoot your buddy in the butt. I don't, what was that? The TV is still on? That's pretty impressive. 
old tech, super durable. <laughs> Pretty good action choreography there. He jumps down the stairs. <laughs> broken ankle. If better a broken ankle than being blown up by a grenade. You ever see Nicolas Cage or Gerald Butler get a broken ankle jumping from an explosion? If you're an action star, nothing can Doesn't happen. happen. Doesn't happen. Unless, it's, oh, you unless you're Tom Cruise. Let me go! Let me go! Roger. I'd take that shot yeah. 10 times out of 10. Yeah, you gotta go for it. Exactly. Just know your holds. It's all about yeah. knowing your holds. If you know yourself and your weapon, yeah, you can do that. We would also train that drill too. You'd put a target and then you'd staple another target over it and yeah, then we would we do turn, turn around, engage two rounds, bang bang, and as fast as possible without hitting the target in front of it. So we would train that. Ah, uh, the wolf is gone. I will follow you into battle even later. Yeah, she's cool, man. She's messing around. Nope. Don't play no sh. That was great. That was fantastic. Hope you Sorry, what? just had to let no, that No, no, it's okay. No, it's, please, please continue to. Go, 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 go. Good, good, good. That's good. If you want to see more videos like this, go to Gameology's Facebook and YouTube page. But wait, there's more. If you guys like street fashion and you want to support a great cause, go ahead and check out my brand, KickUp. If you want to see more of me, go to twitch.tv slash myhappyself. Kill him. <laughs> Even though nobody holds, I don't know where this came from. Nobody I don't holds know. This is like these this. are my weapon hands. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> that to my face and then I'll run away. 81. We know how you guys work.